Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem of k power 3 is equal to 1 to find the values of k from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this one to the left side. So it will be k power of 3, 1 will take to this side to be minus 1 is equal to 0. Then it will be k power of 3 minus 1 is same as 1 power of 3, then is equal to 0. Then from here in the left side is in the form of difference of two cubes. So we'll apply difference of two cubes rule of a power of 3 minus b power of 3 is equal to a minus b bracket times bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket. Then we'll apply this form of a minus b, it will be k minus 1. So here it is k minus 1 bracket, then bracket a square, it will be k square. Then plus a b, it will be k times 1, it is k. Then plus b square, it will be 1 square, which is 1. Bracket is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here we have two solutions. Whereas this first solution of k minus 1 is equal to 0. And this second solution of k square plus k plus 1 is equal to 0. Then from this first solution, we'll take negative 1 to this side. So it will be k is equal to 1. So this is the first value of k, which is real solution. Then to solve from this quadratic equation, we'll use quadratic formula to find the values of k. So from quadratic formula, which is k is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Whereas a is equal to coefficient of k square, it is 1. And b is equal to coefficient of k is 1 and c is equal to constant which is 1 so it will be k is equal to negative b it is 1 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 1 square then minus 4 times a is 1 times c is 1 then over 2 times a it is 1 then it will be k is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 1 square, it is 1. Negative 4 times 1 times 1, it is negative 4. Then over 2 times 1, it is 2. Then it will be k is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 1 minus 4, it is minus 3. Then over 2. So it will be k is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of negative 3 is same as 3 times negative 1 then over this 2 so it will be k is equal to negative 1 plus or minus square root of 3 here square root of 3 square root of negative 1 it is i so here times i then over this 2 therefore it will be k is equal to negative 1 plus or minus, we start with this i, then times square root of 3 over 2. So from here we have two complex solutions because of this imaginary here. Therefore, the first value of k is equal to this here, which is real solution, it is equal to 1. The second value of k is equal to here, when it is positive, to be negative 1 plus i squared of 3 over 2. So, negative 1 plus i squared root of 3 over 2. The third value of k is equal to negative 1 minus i squared root of 3 over 2. So, here, negative 1 minus i squared root of 3 over 2. So, we have one real solution and two complex solutions. So these are all the values of k in this our problems. We have three values of k. 
Now let's check for re this real solution of k is equal to 1. Now to check for k it is equal to 1, so it will be 1 power of 3, it is still 1, so 1 is equal to 1. So left side and right side are equal for the real solution. Also for the complex solution, it is correct. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.